and doing some more Terraria. Did a little bit this morning. Decided to keep on rolling with it since I wanted to get to all of the, the various stuff that I was looking for kind of off screen. You know, the boring bits, everything like that. Uh, specifically, you can see how many more cells I have now. Yep, I was able to get the Tiki Mask. After a little bit of grinding myself. Oh, yay. Hooray, good stuff. I also fixed the house. So, I, all my NPCs are now back here. <laughs> Don't worry about it, nobody died. Although, in the process of, of making the house, I encountered not only one, but... Uh, uh, and I encountered uh, a solar eclipse, but also a blood moon. So, you know, hey, the game really didn't want me to make that house. I don't really know why. <laughs> it's... Uh, I don't have any reason exactly why that would be. But anyway, I don't really have much of an idea. So I guess I'm just going to start out with a little bit of fishing so that I can get the rest of the buffs so that we can continue on with the whole uh, finding the moon lord and finishing up that whole thing. Ah, what happened here? Oh, right. The, um the explosions <laughs> it's punishment for breaking down the shitty house nah, whatever it's fine i'm not gonna say that the new house is all that much better but it's like hey i think people are gonna be happier with it if nothing else Ooh, uh also one of the things i did do was build a whole bunch of buckets so that i can get buckets of honey did I oh my god the blood moon is already back i cannot get away from this oh why does the game hate me Somebody tell me. Do you have the honey dispenser? I did, but I um, I sold that. So it wasn't able to be included in the new house. Whatever. It's fine. It doesn't really matter. All right. Now, I was thinking about getting some... Uh, now that I'm going for something of a summoner build with all the cells that I got going on here, it's... Uh, I, I, I wanted to go for the uh, variegated... Variegated? Uh, lardfish? Whatever it's called. The thing to make the summon potion. There's summon potions. I want to make the summon push potion. I'm just going to go do that, I guess, while I'm going to be accosted by a million different animals because of the blood moon. Oh, cannot get away from this now, can I? No honey for furniture? I mean, I... Uh, look, I would have if I could, but I couldn't. So I didn't. <laughs> it's simple. How is chat today? Ah, oh, you know, same thing. I guess I'm not technically chat, but I am chatting. Uh, two Terraria streams in one day. I mean, it's only because I'm just... We're so close to the end. <laughs> and also, there was a lot of stuff that I needed to do. So, I did it. Alright, let's get a good fishing hole here. Something that's kind of tight in an area. And one where I'm not going to be uh, attracting too many unwanted visitors. And pour all of my blood water into this. Make another world, get a honey dispenser, and make honey furniture. That's, I don't think that's worth it. And I don't think I have one in, like, another world right now. You could not finish this. I had a feeling we were so close. We were so close. I mean, it's just... How can I resist, really? Oh, actually, before I do that, let's actually switch on this. A whole bunch of buffs and everything going on here, but... I shouldn't need them right now. Come on, really? You're going to do me like that? Okay, well, just do this then. And then start with a little bit of fishing. Let's start out the stream with a little bit of fishing. Ain't nothing with fishing. Ain't nothing wrong with fishing. Yes, it is. Now do it or I leave. But fine. Oh, actually, that's what I'm looking for. I want a whole bunch of those guys. I mean, we can, we can go to... Let me get at least a couple um, variegated blood uh, barred fish or whatever they're called first, and then we can then we can go get the honey dispenser and make some honey furniture and whatever. I don't care. <laughs> I mean, the honey furniture does look good. It has a very nice golden color to it, and it's very honey-themed, as you would expect. But it's just like, is it worth it? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, you can do it. I mean, it would just be a very quick jaunt over the jungle in one of the other areas and then grab that and go. Okay, how much did I miss today and yesterday? Oh, okay. We summoned the Moon Lord, but I completely failed at it. Just, like, utterly. <laughs> it was pretty bad. And now I'm instead doing a little bit of a... A uh, little bit of a summoner build, what with my cell friends. 
Because of course it had to be the cell friends. You've seen this channel. It had to be the cells. Taking a break from Moon Lord. I mean, it's more specifically that now I got a uh, summoner's build going on here. I'm fishing up some of the summoning potion stuff. And then we're going to go back. And then we're going to go back and do it again. Don't even worry. Don't even fret. Don't even make no mistake. All right, let's go get that honey dispenser and go make some, a little bit of honey furniture. Why not? I'm sure that, like, one of the... Let's go in Uwu. Why not? <laughs> it's a, it's a tiny, that's a tiny area. Oh, and there's actually a honey dispenser right here. Never mind. So that's even easier than I thought it was going to be. Yoink. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot the <laughs> mismatched walls right behind there, isn't it? Good lord. What's wrong? <laughs> this is... Is it that I called it Uwu? Look, I got a brand to keep up here. <laughs> This is important to me. Anyway, is there anything else I want to steal here before I go back to uh, Prime World? <laughs> oh, I got glass. I actually do like glass items, so it might be worth kind of having that hang around. Uh, nothing else here of any real interest, though. Throw that in there. All right, let's go back. To oh, wait. Yeah, <laughs> just before I forget. No, that's several houses. Nobody likes my house making ability. I frank, uh, frankly, I have no idea what pe what problem people have with this sort of thing. Anyway, here's a new house, by the way. Uh, need to need to make the the lard fish stuff. Uh, I gotta go find the guide real quick and um, see if. Because I don't remember how you actually make the summoning potions, so I gotta go look that up real quick. Uh, where is it? Oh, I can also throw down the honey dispenser, and we can start do doing the, the, the honey furniture then, too. Oh, yeah, it's a full moon. Give me one second here. <laughs> it shouldn't really be that big of a deal, but I do need to resummon everything at this point in time, too. Oh yeah, I got all this stuff next to my um summon uh, my summon or the teleport area here, so it should be should be a lot easier to get all my buffs back up. However, uh, there's there's the guide. Here we go. Yo, how do I make the the bardfish potion again? Oh, uh, summoning. Okay, I just need moon glow. That's pretty easy. Okay. Uh, I should have a lot of moon glow at this point in time. And that will be all I need to, you know, make my, make the, this, all the buffs that I need for some time here. Well, four is not a ton, but it's enough. It's enough. All right. Uh, yeah, if you want to see the entire house, here we go. I thought I did a pretty good job. It's a, you know, it's a hard thing to make a to make a house look good, but I think I succeeded here in a lot of ways. Okay, let's just get going here. Uh, there's a lot more stuff to do after all. What? I don't really know. I could easily go make some like, some wrath potions and stuff like that, but yeah, also archery potions are also going to to work out pretty well here. There's a lot going on. I mean, yeah, we, we're, we're, we're approaching the end of the game. There's a lot of stuff to, to do. A lot of stuff left to do, even despite the fact that I'm up against the final boss. It's just like, you gotta create a proper arena, everything like that, too. Oh, I never actually did anything with the honey crafting. Let's get back to the house. Oh, do I even have, like, a place I can put the honey dispenser right now? Um, yeah, sure. Right up here near the clocks. There we go. Looking good. Yeah, this is the current world. This is the same world that I've been in before. Can't you can't you recognize it? I know it's got a new house, but it's like just because my stupid commie blocks aren't there anymore, that really shouldn't make all that much of a difference. It's still very recognizable as the same place, right? No, see, look, I can go. Here's the entrance all the way down to the underworld again. Remember? Remember this thing? Isn't the Moon Lord's Arena just an asphalt bridge? I mean, I guess it could be. 
Yeah, you remember like all the, the ultra bright torches, the, this annoying bit here and everything like that? It's like the, the same world. It's a, it's a, it is the same world we've all come to know and love. I don't know what to, I don't see what you people are even talking about. Even up here, like here's the, here's this guy and everything. I want you to do off stream. Well, I mean, I built the house and I also got the uh, got the tiki armor off stream, and that's about uh, off, off. Yeah, off stream, off screen, off stream is kind of the same thing in this case. Isn't it? Uh, when did you fight the Moon Lord? This morning. I, I did a I did an EU friendly stream. So you know, oh oh no, fast clock. I, I need a megaphone. I need a megaphone, but for some reason that's just not really been working. I also need some more prismite, so. So I can start doing some of the uh, the the health potion stuff here too. Oh boy! Hey, an apple. Cool. <laughs> that could be useful. How would be? I mean, it's going pretty good. I've I've kind of accomplished a lot of the stuff I want. Not everything, but we're getting there. But cells. I got the cells. The prismite is just to get the to get more. Um, the prismite is just to get more uh, health. That's the one that gives you 20% extra health. It's pretty wor worthwhile. Hopefully you won't die from poverty again. I hope not. <laughs> we'll see how that works. Uh, I'm going to have to go fight all the pillars again. I guess I might as well go get to that. Just beat the game already? If I could, I would have. I sacrificed so much, you don't even understand. It's all for you. But you don't even care. Okay, anyway. Get back to the house here and... Uh, what was I looking for? Um, I guess we're just going to go start up the thing. Whatever. Uh, start up the, the garbage again. You know, doing all of the stuff. With oh, nice. Okay. Uh, I don't really need any more marble blocks after all. Okay. Uh... There we go. Uh, let's uh, yeah, let's go beat up the the guy again and there. <laughs> let's go beat up the the one fellow again and then should be good at this point to uh, beat all of the the towers comparatively. No Stardust Dragon. I had to take the cells. <laughs> I had to take the cells. Come on, man. I mean, it's like it's in the name. <laughs> it's the cell staff. Get yourself a stealth staff infection. Terrible. Staff infection. There you go. Ugh. Yeah, we're doing the super modded after I beat Moon Lord. And then in the new world. I don't want people screwing up my new beautiful house. <laughs> beat the Moon Lord with a copper short sword. How would that even work? What sort of madness are you on about? Oh, I do actually have all the empty buckets right here. For some reason, I thought that I had that in my um, other area. Well, whatever, it doesn't matter. The collector cosplay. I mean, he, he just has a hood. He doesn't have the whole mask going on. I don't have the PC version. Yeah, it doesn't work if you don't. No crossplay. Just an unfortunate part of life. How's it going, dude? Making a lot of progress. Making a lot of progress. Hopefully, we'll actually finish the damnable game tonight. We'll see. Oh, great. The mechanic's back. <laughs> kind of worried about that for a second when I saw that she died. Hey, nerdlingers. Mysterious tablet. Hey, lunatic cultist. Let's buff this up and then... Yeah. This will hopefully go a little bit better. First off, getting a larger area. Yeah, I'm already doing so much more damage. Look at that go. Look at he go. <laughs> You have to still make sure I. I gotta still make sure that I'm careful here. I. Not a more. There we go. There we go. Great. Now I'm gonna teleport out of here before I get killed by a Stardust Dragon. And I suppose I now have another um another uh thing to put down. You know, let's just throw this one down right here. <laughs> Why not? I mean, you tend to get a lot of those things if you are you know. Uh, working with a 
if, if you tend to be failing against the Moon Lord a lot, you get a lot of the uh, ancient manipulators, all that sort of thing. It's annoying. All right, uh, let's get back down here. Re-up all of my stuff, and then let's go fight some of these fools. Because it is, uh... It should be a lot easier, if nothing else. <laughs> what is even what house? It's the new house! I destroyed the house last time because everybody hated it, and I rebuilt it better than ever. I don't... Uh, everybody keeps... I don't know why people have such a problem with how I build houses. Like, what's the deal, dog? <laughs> I'm trying my best. I don't know how you can navigate that house without a rod of discord. I have a rod of discord. I got it uh, on stream, actually. It was pretty, pretty convenient. Also, it's navigable. I made sure that it was navigable. <laughs> it's, it's cool. I'm going to have to teleport away back to the house here. Like, yeah, you want to see me navigate without a rod of discord? Like, what do you... Like, what? <laughs> it's easy. <laughs> like, what's, what's the big deal? We do have to go outside here, though. And then, like, into this area if you want to talk to these people. It's easy. <laughs> like, what's the, what's, what's the problem? Oh, uh, yeah, right down here. And then you got to go up here if you want to go talk to the demolitionist. Go up here and up here. Like, what's the big deal? What's the problem? I don't know. You people are weird. That's what. Anyway. Oh, I got another ancient cultist mask. Neat. And yeah. Rod of Discord does make it a lot easier to get around, but it makes it a lot easier to get around in any house. You know what they say, haters gonna hate. Yeah, love is gonna love. <laughs> All that. Anyway, what's the point I'm trying to get at? I don't know. I'm still not invincible, that is the problem. I need more and better armor over time. Because <laughs> as of just yet... Wait, I did... It, yes, okay. <laughs> I was worried there for a second. Oh, this is always, like, the worst one to do. Because if you jump off the ground, you get um, powerful worms attacking you in a very irritating fashion. Yeah, those those fellows up there. Crawlipedes, I believe they're called. Uh, Discord is bugged in the mobile version. The enemy drops it only spawns, like, 0.3% of the time. Ah, ah, I gotta leave again. Only spawns, like, 3.3% of the time. And it only drops it at a 1% rate. I mean, yeah, it always drops it at a 1% rate, but the minimal spawning for the... For the, what is that? Like, the, the Chaos Elemental or whatever? Some dumb name. Uh, dumb concept, causing chaos. Why would you want to do that? But, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you don't have that spawn a whole lot, it's kind of rough. Ah! So anyway, uh, oh, I might actually be able to go and uh, talk with you again, if I'm not mistaken. Cotton honey, oh boy. That's going to be kind of rough to do. Might be worth just kind of skipping that one for a while. Ah. Corruption is literally world cancer, according to the, the lore, so removing... It, I mean, it's like cancer you normally can't remove just by using a clentamator. I mean, I'd like it if we could, but you can't. It's not a thing. All right, heal up here. And gotta, gotta be getting close. Come on, man. How much more do you need from me? Those crawlipedes are very worrying. But it's world cancer. Yeah, so what is this, like a, a Kingdom Hearts thing? You got like a World Keyblade versus a, a Heart of World Keyblade versus a Heart of Pre People Keyblade, like the one that, uh, like the one that Riku got after he took the hearts of the various princesses who were only, pe oh, ooh, who were the only ones pure enough to be able to create a Keyblade out of that alone. Probably he's noticing me. Ah, and I actually did kill it. Why do you have four workbenches placed next to each other? Ooh. Looks like my mind goes comfortably numb. And good. I'm glad that I could uh, make that reference again. 
Can I join? Ah, I'm just doing it single player. We are going to do like a big, huge multiplayer thing once I actually beat the Moon Lord. So at that point in time, feel free. <laughs> Until then, though, we're going to have to. It, it's, I, I, I want to do it solo. I want to go solo. Look, mate, I love you, but if you come at me with, K with Kingdom Hearts stuff, I'm going to kick you. You know I can't not do that. Anyway, I need to have the verse benches here because otherwise, you know, you slow down a lot when you're walking on honey. So I need to be able to walk on some. So yeah, uh, yeah, right. Forgot I kind of made that a little bit difficult to go through. I do have a keyblade right here. By the way, the kingdom key is actually like, you know, the, the big, probably most important keyblade in the entire lore because it's it's the counterpart to like the it's the Kingdom Blade of Light versus the Kingdom Blade of Darkness, which Mickey has. Here it is. Check it out. <laughs> Alright, anyway, uh, let's go. Continue on here. I mean, it's like, you'd think the Kingdom Key would have like a lot more power, but I don't think it's any more powerful than like the any of the Kingdom, any of the other Keyblades in the existence of the lore. I don't really understand it. Why exactly? I mean, even like the 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 cross blade, like the most powerful keyblade of them all, is made of like two different kingdom keys. And yet Sora just kinda is, you know, it's fine. It works well. You have the gold lamp pet? Unfortunately I don't. I probably would have used that if I did, but it's just that's 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 that one's rough to get, you know? Okay. Yeah, just have the phrase, Mickey has the key of darkness. Okay, now here's the thing. Uh, Mickey had gone to, like, the, the realm of darkness. Okay, so normally people live in the realm of light. And the realm of darkness is where there's, like, a, well, a lot of other heartless and everything like that. He went to the realm of darkness to get a keyblade of his own. That was how he got his own keyblade. And he got a keyblade of that world, which is the, the keyblade of darkness. It's just a it's just an inverted color version of the kingdom key. You understand? <laughs> it's it's really not anything like particularly it's not evil or anything, because light, light nor dark are evil. They they both just exist. They're both there. So I hope that explains what, what I was talking about when I'm talking about Mickey having a keyblade of darkness. It's just that he managed to get a keyblade for, he managed to get the kingdom key of the of the realm of darkness. They're, they're both, like, equally powerful as compared to any other Keyblade that you get in the, in the series. <laughs> oh, no, not KH lore. I don't know what you're talking about. I waited four in-game days to get it. The, the Keyblade? <laughs> yeah, I can believe that. It's kind of a rare drop. I've only gotten one despite farming the... Despite farming the uh, uh, dungeon quite a bit. It's filler time. Yep. You know it. Unfortunately, it's just like, I'm still not doing great. The gold lamp. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the thing that, uh, it's one of the light pads. But you have to, like, get him when it's, when it's the full moon. It's, it's hard. It's hard to do, really. And I think that it's, it's not really worth it for the most part. Uh, to try to find the, the merchant, the skeleton merchant at that point in time. It's because it is so rough. How's it going? Going pretty good. People have been really loving the new house I created. Which is cool. I haven't seen that. Oh, no, I'm dying. Oh, well. I don't like that Darkness is told off and talk about his own entity when it's really just an absence of light. Well, and the thing is, it's like uh, Darkness is light at the same time in the Kingdom Hearts lore. Uh, as we found out at the at the end of the first game where, where you know, uh, Sora actually proclaimed that King... That, uh, Kingdom Hearts, you know, the the door created of the of, of a bunch of world hearts was, did blow open to reveal a lot of light. I mean, that's just a part of the, the lore again. Get all my cells back out here and let's let's get back, I suppose. Uh, and I'm not going to like this, but you know. What's your favorite movie? I, mean, I don't really watch a whole lot of movies to have a favorite Specifically. Um, what else? What else? I guess eat the fog again. <laughs> hey, I swear I'll leave if you keep up the KH talk. 
there's a lot to talk about with Kingdom Hearts, man. I mean, there's like, there is a Kingdom Hearts, for example, and then there's the Kingdom Hearts. You see, the Kingdom Hearts is all worlds. Every single world combined in one. It's, it was like at the, where light came from in the first place. Whereas just like, you can also make just a regular Kingdom Hearts, usually from like a, a bunch of people's hearts or a bunch of world hearts. But I mean, in like Kingdom Hearts 2, for example, it was created from the hearts of a bunch of different people. So it's, it, but there are just like a uh, pale comparisons compared to the true Kingdom Hearts that exist in the lore. <laughs> okay, I love you, GG. Good night. <laughs> uh, Kingdom Hearts is fun. <laughs> anyway, I should. You know what? I I don't have the UFO. I should go get the UFO. That's a good. That is a good mount. Uh, just rename the video to Kingdom Hearts lore discussion at this point. I haven't played all the Kingdom Hearts games. I don't really know exactly how Birth by Sleep and especially like Kingdom Hearts 3 goes to be able to, to talk about the full Xenonord saga to, like accurately. I mean, I can give my own like speculation on probably what happened and everything like that, but I haven't played the game. I mean, like how did, uh, how did the new Organization 13 turn out? I assume that uh, Xemnas and Xenord and everybody like that did manage to get all 13 members in one way or another. You know, through, um, possessions, time travel, all that sort of stuff. But I don't really know exactly how it shook out. He was pretty close to making the entirety of the new Organization 13 by the end of, like, a Dream Drop Distance. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that. I'm having a lot of- we're all having a lot of fun here, but we gotta stop with the- with the King of Hearts. <laughs> Okay, okay. Hopefully there's not going to be too much here left to, uh... Bioshock Infinite were good, but Bioshock 1 and 2 were, was cooler. Bioshock Infinite was also really different compared to the, the first couple Bioshocks. Taking a, taking a whole different sort of uh, stance on how everything worked. I mean, it was just, you know, in the Bioshock world, I suppose. Once again, this sounds like you're pulling lore out of thin air. But no! Xemnas... Uh, Zenonort, what, what is his name? Ansem, 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 uh, created, thir had 13 versions of him. No, I said we weren't going to continue doing this. <laughs> uh, anyway. I'm in a shower with my phone listening to music, and a notification came up saying Terraria stream came as fast as I could. Yeah, I rebuilt the house. Check it out. <laughs> you know, everybody wanted me to destroy the house because it was so bad before, but I rebuilt it better than ever. So, I mean, I guess maybe there was something to that, if you think about it. Okay. I rebuilt the house from the ground up. I had to do that because I destroyed it last time. Don't you remember? In the last stream, it was destroyed. <laughs> so this is the new and improved house that everybody wanted. It's great. All right, let's keep let's get back out of here. Oh, look, teleport back into the house. Whoops. There we go. All right, let's continue here. And what was I doing? Got a bunch of junk here that I don't really need. I mean, I guess I could put this in the house, but who cares? It doesn't really make, give all that much of a... Not really too much of a point to me, really. How long did it take you to build? I don't know. It was a labor of love. I was thinking about you, chat, the entire time I was building it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> This is what everybody... Yeah, I mean, you look at it, but it's like you just don't see the beauty in it. <laughs> no, you weren't. Oh, yes, I was. <laughs> I can assure you that I was thinking about chat. Every single brick I laid down. And how they didn't like my house before. And how I'd show them. <laughs> uh. So anyway, let's get back to finishing up the... Uh, the uh, the thing here shouldn't be too much more. I mean, this is probably the other most obnoxious one to do. Everything else should be a little bit of an improvement. Sacrifices? That, that what? There was nothing that was sacrificed. This is a new being created entirely for the sake of you, the chat. Ah, get off me! Oh man. I do think the the uh, pillar should be down at this point in time, so I 
can probably uh, go and take it out. However, I am worried about, you know, dying there. All we wanted was the doors for not, not to hang over nothing. Oh, I guess I still do that. I can add on to this house a little bit more if you want to... If you want that to be fixed. There can be a little bit more... Uh, there's room for a little bit more things. A couple more things there. Yeah, the, the red... Um, th there's like a little red beam that flies off into the pillar from an enemy you kill from the pillar. Any of the pillar-specific enemies. So when they stop flying off of the enemies, then you know that the... Pillar is unshielded. It's uh it's it's helpful because you generally don't want to be next to the pillar because then enemies are attacking you on every single side, and it's pretty rough. And enemies are gonna to continue to spawn until I take out that pillar, so let's go do that right now. I can. Yep, it is definitely open. Take it out! Oh, just look at all those damage numbers fly. Wait. Okay, it's gone. Now just destroy these things. And snatch up my prize. There we go. Okay. Five cell curse sword only? Curse sword only? Oh boy. <laughs> that would be something. I mean, I'm, I'm generally not a big fan of inflicting pain on myself, so probably not going to do that anytime soon. Oh, there we go. Looks looking good. Looking cool, Joker. And solar fragments. Have I fought Fishman? You know, I haven't. Should I go do that? Ah. Should I go do that at some point in time here? I mean, that would be uh, that would be something to get done. That would be something to, uh, to ch check off the list. Yes. Uh, let's, yeah, let's uh, let's go. Um, I'm sure I can go find a, a truffle worm somewhere around here. There are air. I mean, actually, it would be very easy to do with the contaminator. Yeah, yeah, I could do that pretty easily. All right, let's get up to this guy, and then. Yes, this is actually probably the easiest way to do it because I can just go turn a bunch of, uh, I can just go turn a bunch of the area into stuff. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh. Issue is they technically skipped him and don't have the weapons that would make him not hard. I feel like I got some weapons that would make him not hard here. <laughs> Maybe not everything that would make him not hard, but it's like, with all these potion charges and everything like that, I should be fine. Randomized gear wasn't good. You had a chance to get the winter shield, but also a chance to get the to get ammo cap practically trash. For what? Uh, I'm drunk. Cool. <laughs> You'll probably enjoy the stream more then. Let's be honest. You're going to beat him easy. I mean, honestly, I would probably be drunk right now, but I don't. I mean, I would have to, like, I don't have any mixers here. And I don't want to do stuff without mixers. I want a mixer with my, my Elky Hall. Elky Hal. You're going to beat him easy? Good. <laughs> I hope so. Okay. Now, I'll just go duck down into the jungle. It's a jungle out there, and I won't have to wonder how I keep from going under, because I'm just going to go down. All right, so if I just go in here, uh, contaminator a blazing, I should be able to get a truffle worm pretty easily. Because there will be a lot of places for that little saucy fellow to spawn sooner than later. And here we go. Phantasm is like really top tier. I know, that's why I got it. <laughs> it's a pretty good weapon. And although I am mostly built for uh, using using a lot of, um... Uh oh Am I considered inside the jungle? <laughs> I hope so. No, I'm not considered in the jungle when I'm in here. Oh, Lord, he coming. Uh, let's take care of this really quick. Hmm? Did he despawn? Oh, he despawned. Okay, never mind then. Doesn't matter. 
And yeah. I mean, you see, the best thing about this is that I have the the uh, rare enemy detector, so I'll be able to see when the when the uh, thing is around here, the thing that I'm looking for. And that'll be very useful. Who's gonna spawn? I spawned Plantera accidentally because if you uh, contaminate a Plantera bulb, it instantly spawns it. But it despawned trying to catch up with me, I guess. So who cares? <gasps> Wait, there it is. Oh, okay. Uh. Okay. Um, you. Okay. Now ready and go. Got it. Let's go. Who's ready to see it? You summon? No, I found the way summons don't kill the worm. That actually is uh kind of shocking myself now that you bring it up. Huh? Didn't really think of it. Okay. You almost threw a bone at it. <laughs> yeah, I know. Why do I even have these on here? Oh, that, it's, here we go. Yeah, there's a few um doors that are going nowhere here. I suppose that is kind of. Like, still a thing. I guess I'll have to fix that at some point in time. Uh, but not right now. Not right now. We got other things. Other more important things to do at this point in time. First off, junk and all of this. And second off, replace the bone. What do I need the bone for? Get out of here, bones. I love your house. Me too. I'm a big fan. I don't think anybody's going to complain about the house now. It's, it's, uh, it is, it has reached its final form. Destruction of the previous house, which was forced upon me by the chat, I want to say has been has been recompensed tenfold. <laughs> so let's continue. Uh, summons don't attack worm because it's not a hostile enemy. Yeah, it actually runs away from you, which is kind of annoying with that. You only getting one worm? Someone's confident. Perhaps too confident. I also have a ton of buffs and everything like this. It's ready to go, man. If I'm not prepared for this at this point in time with like... Uh, right pre moon lord equipment and like you know all this sort of stuff it's like how when am i gonna be ready oh you're closing off sky doors well to do it right now do you want me to go do it right now for sake doing uh duke fishman and go and do that instead is that really worthwhile if you're not prepared for moon lord you ain't killing duke mate this is an expert mode i think i'll be fine i think i should be fine go Ugh. You know, if you let other players in your game, your house is toast. Eh, whatever. I can understand that. Uh, but I'm also not going to let them in this game. It's going to be a new world. Or maybe like one of the other worlds that I'm in. I died to Duke with Moon Gear. Yeah, but again, it's not expert. This is not expert mode. We should be good. It'll be fine. <laughs> All right. Dark blue solution, switch that out for this, since I'm probably going to have to contaminate the shoreline. <laughs> As you do. As you do. Yep, and I definitely will. Shoreline contaminated. And there. Oh yeah, jellyfish necklace, cool. Alright. Buff. Summon as many more of these as I can, and let's go. Uh, I got the, the bait, right? Hello? Do I gotta drop this or something? Fine. Now there's only one thing that's bait. There it is. See, I told you it was going to be fine. Duke Fishman ain't got nothing on me. And there it is. And you doubted me. Okay, where's, where's like the actual... Hey, I got the Razor Blade Typhoon. Cool. That's cool. 
Okay, cool. Me, me, me. Okay, uh... Don't remember Fishron being too hard. He did do a lot of damage, to be fair. Wow, you did it. I'm sorry for doubting you, as you should be. Yeah, buffs and everything like that makes it pretty... Not too bad, I want to say. Hm. I don't know if that's any good, though. Favorite weapon in the game? It's so good. Eh. Freaking hard in expert mode. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> but it's like, I wasn't doing this in expert mode, baby. So it worked out just fine for me. All right. Uh, just kind of swoops everything into my various stuff. Uh, is this the same world you destroyed the earlier today? Yeah. Yeah, it's the same one. I, I rebuilt the house. Like, why do you think it's not the same world? He See, here's Truffle looking exactly like he was before. I think Xenostaff has a higher DPS than Dead Cells. I mean, maybe? Yeah, like, here, here's the thing. Here's the, the thing. It's why, why would you doubt that this is the same world? The house is... It's just the house that's new. I put a little bit of TLC into it, certainly. But, you know, that's about it. <laughs> Will multiplayer be today? I feel like that's probably going to be a little bit difficult to actually do. Hey, at least I'd be Duke Fishron. That was, that's not an easy task, you know? All right. Oh, uh, because I just came in and saw a huge house. <laughs> I mean, what? Dude, like, you really think that sort of house takes all that long to make? It's pretty Spartan, all things considered. Oh. It was a pretty easy... Ma oh, wait. Oh. Oh! <laughs> I didn't even realize that I was getting attacked right now. <laughs> by the... By the, the thing. Okay, anyway. A summon's really helping out here a lot. Boy, look at that. Look at it go. In fact, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... Go, my cells. Do mine bidding. <laughs> ah, good stuff, good stuff. Multi, if you kill Moon Lord or die to it. Or die to it? I feel like that's not really the the proper um, force of action, all things considered. And don't teleport yet until the thing's gone. Okay. It does do damage to you. All right, let's keep going. Using cells because you're main. I mean, yeah. Xenostaff is higher, but the dead cells are dead cells. Exactly. And I think that that's really, really the, the thing you got to take into consideration, if anything. Will you ever play with mods? I mean, the, the multiplayer thing is planned to be with mods. <laughs> so. But yeah. Yeah, eventually. I'd like to say. Okay. Doc, I'm going on holiday tomorrow. I swear if you open multi tomorrow. Well, I won't do it then. That's fine. I, it's not like I'm in any rush to do that right now. It would just... It's like, you know, installing mods and everything like that would take a while to do. <laughs> installing the mods and, like, troubleshooting. And I'm sure there's going to be a lot of troubleshooting when it comes to... When it comes to uh, getting, like, multiplayer work in here. It's going to be a whole thing. Why is it so asymmetric? I don't know. Like, what? Well, how's that the problem? <laughs> and bazinga. Pillar down. Pillar status men. <laughs> okay. Oh, I guess I'll keep the banners. I'm sure I can probably do something with that. Oh, and then one more until we get the Moon Lord on me once again. You have to port forward, and also you might not want to use your own IP. Oh, man. Yeah, that's going to be an entire thing. Maybe I don't want to do it multiplayer then. Ugh. Sounds like a real Hasslevania. And you'd be coming up to the next pillar, like, right over here. 
Will multiplayer be with this degenerate chat? I mean, I don't know of any other degenerate chat that would be willing to join in. <laughs> oh, here it goes. And this is the summon guys, and I got summon guys going on here. I'd like to say that I'm probably going to be pretty old car. This is, you know, just coming home, really. All right. Will you stream for those of us who won't be participating? Well, yeah, of course. <laughs> I mean, it's not going to be just, like, me here. That would be weird. Oh, got bit in half by a Milky Way Weaver. Good old Milk and Ways Weavers. Going to be a lot of hassle. Ugh. Terrible. Now, let's throw down some of these banners here. Just kind of get them out of the inventory. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I like to say it adds to the general aesthetic. Yo. Um, all right, all right. Uh, I kind of want to be careful with my potion charges, it looks like. You know, lest it become too, uh, too much of a problem not having those there. All right, all right, all right, all right. Actually, I'm look I want to look right now. Um, get out my... Get out my uh, piggy bank here and see if I can't um, just make a Moon Lord summoning thing anyway. Because that might might just be the case. <laughs> no, I really do need more of this. Do I? Why though? That really feels like I shouldn't need that. Because it's like it's 20 each, right? I should have 20 each. Oh? Where is everything? Oh, I need to go get my... um. Solar fragments out there. That's what I was looking for. All right. There's one. Ready to go. Hot and fresh out the kitchen. The remix of ignition. Uh. Working that body got every man in here wishing. Okay. No Minecraft swing. I mean, I just, I don't know this song anyway, so we did so I did it in ignition instead. <laughs> that should show you where I'm at. All right. Oh yeah, I suppose I'm probably gonna need to do something about this door being open on the edges on both sides. All right. Someone's all bosses killing everyone. That's what I'm betting. <laughs> That's what I'm. That's what I am planning on. Let's be honest here. That's the most likely situation to happen here. Yeah, the vortex stuff is kind of what I'm running, running out for. All right. Let's keep going here. I can never forget those eyes, eyes, eyes. Your eyes hypnotize, but why I, I do you stay by my side? Um, okay. keep going here. Oh, one more chance at beating the Moon Lord. The Moon Lord, as I like to say. And I don't think I'm going to do it, but I'm going to give it a real attempt. Well, let's actually kind of like check out what uh, the Razor Blade Typhoon has going on here. Seems like it might be a fun item. Pew, pew, pew. It's not like my equipment is built towards um, anything that I'm using right now. So, I mean, yeah, I guess it homes and everything. That's kind of cool. You probably switch out for my phantasm when I run out of mana, though. And then back to Razor Blade Hyper. Yeah, maybe I'll get that uh, re-rolled a little bit. See if I can't uh, get something good going on. Is that like a Weeb Terraria mod? Yeah, probably. I mean, that's usually how mods tend to go. <laughs> that's usually the direction that they, they tend to, to, to go in. <laughs> and come on. Someone will just blow up everything. I mean, again, I'm counting on it. As I expect that sort of thing to happen. 
think I should re-roll this and try to get like a better uh, better version of the Razor Blade Typhoon. I didn't realize that it homed in on enemies. Hmm. Seems pretty good. Just landmine spam spawn. <laughs> I mean, I guess that would be one way to do it. <laughs> I don't know if it's the best way to do it, but it would be one. <laughs> Can't say it wouldn't. Yeah, get out of here, you wolf. Oh, man, is the, the barrier still not down yet? I mean, come on. Don't worry, I'll blow it all up again. Of course. I'm going to build a house in space <laughs> with Alex and live a peaceful life if anybody wants to join. And why would you? That's not what the point of this is. Ah! Oh, no, I closed. I made my window smaller. There we go. <laughs> Why is it so easy to do that? You get the worm scarf, it'd take two minutes. Yeah, it'd probably help a lot. It gives you like straight uh, damage reduction. It's only like 10% or something though, right? I mean, it's not a lot. Oh, come on now. Ugh. Yeah, 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 cells. The cells are killing me once again, as it turns out. Who could have seen that coming? Alright, let's uh warp up here, warp up here. Hey yo. And warp one more over here and let's go. Should be pretty easy to get this done. Expert multiplayer. Oh, and actually before I before I go do that, let's go um re-roll the the stuff here. Re-roll razor blade typhoon. I don't have money. <laughs> All right, then. Well, let's sell some junk then instead. I'm sure I've got a way to get money. Yeah, I don't really need that. I uh, do want all of that. Oh, bones. Who cares about bones. Gone. Gone again. Ugh. Let's just go get back up to my uh, treasure room and see if there's nothing else that I can't get rid of. Like, you I can get rid of, sure, whatever, these don't matter. Okay, I'm gonna need to use that for anything. Oh, uh, come on, come on, come on. There's gotta be something else here. Sure, sure. Oh, uh, yeah. Staff of regrowth is not like I'm gonna be using that anytime soon. We'll have to remember that I put my stuff in there, though. And here we go. Doc, do the far thing. No! I have that there because it's such a rare item. I am not going to do the fart thing. What sort of monster do you take me for? All right, reforge him up, Dan. Manic? Nah. Ugh. Ah. <laughs> Whoops. Um, give me back my razor blade and do it better. Oh, you know what? Okay. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, I don't really have a whole lot of money left, so I guess that'll have to do. Do the fart. Do the fart thing. No! I'm not gonna do the fart thing. What sort of. Again, yeah, what do you take me for here? Somebody that's just gonna do the fart thing? Terrible. All terrible people. Anyway, continuing on. Ah, I have like seven of those things. You do? Wow, that's a lot. <laughs> I mean, just getting the one I would have thought would have been uh, pretty rare. At least that's what I thought. All right, let's get back over there, finish this up, and see what's the crack of lacking. I have no... I just killed four, four cultist guys, and the lunatic is now spawning. Yeah, that's how that works. That's how it do. You got it. And yeah, I don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need all this garbage. A lot of garbage here. Don't need it. Stop telling me to fart. <laughs> Stop it. Don't think that I'm not watching you down there. With your pleas and cries and whines to fart. Bart Simpson. I mean, Bart Samson is really who I would have gone for, but yeah. 
upgrade and a bunch of characters that look just like him. Okay, well, let's take this, this stupid thing down already, since it has, like, so little health left anyway. Oh, man, what a difficult uh, trial and tribulation that was. And now the intending doom. Here it come. Here it comes. I better get back to the house. That's probably going to be the best fortified uh, chance that I got at surviving this whole deal. This ordeal. All right. Um, should have chaos sickness off here. All right. Let's go. Ah, I'm about ready. You can do this. Probably not. <laughs> GG, you're not enough. Fart for our twisted amusement. No! I have wings at this point in time. I need not fart. Anytime now, you saucy fellow. In fact, uh, let's buff up right now since I know it's going to be happening in like literal seconds here. Not the unpleasant razor blade typhoon. Let's go. Okay, come on, man. Oh. Keep going at it. Keep on keeping on, I suppose. You know what? I should probably, like, just jump right back in here for one second and, you know, give you a little chat. Just a little chat. A little bitty bit, bitty, 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 tiny one. And try to remember how to leave my house. Can I remember how to leave my house? We'll, we'll, well, let's, let's play the game. No? Yes. <laughs> well, I'm getting one of the, the hands down here. I suppose that's something. You'll just excuse me for a uno momento. And let's continue going on here. Ah, good old Moon Lord. As tough as ever, I see. Rod of Discord really helping out here, isn't it? Ah, good stuff, good stuff. You won't fart, unsolved. <laughs> That's... That you even need say that is hmm <laughs> suspect true eyes will make all this go downhill yeah probably but you know hey what are you gonna do true eyes do kind of screw up everything now don't they as of right now though it is working and I have a I got a plan a man with plan and it's functioning And it is a functioning plan, let me tell you. Can't say it's not. And... Come on, really take that thing out. Okay. Excuse me. Keep that eye open for a little bit here, my dog. My home slice. Thank you. And let's continue. Yes. Oh, so close. Almost there, almost there. Excuse me one more time. Excusez-moi. Yep, yep, yep. Let me just, uh, let me just make a 
a real quick sort of... Wreck out here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, throwing a party, I see. Cool, cool, cool. Great stuff. Big fan. Big fan of parties. I'll, uh, I'll make sure to show up in a little bit here. Hey, just, you know, gotta... Hey, it's me again. You know how it's going. You know how it's going. Right, right, right. Yeah, cool, cool. We just, uh... Go talk to my good friend, the the nurse, right now, and um. My good, good buddy, old Nursey, I like to call her. Big fan, big fan. Excuse me one more time. Just one more time. Should be totally cool. And there we go. Ah, good stuff, good stuff. Unless the nurse dies. She and she didn't. But now what? The fact you actually managed to did it or the fact the nurse is still giving up, <laughs> putting up with your crap. Hey, and cool, I got the Terrarian. <laughs> Neat. That's a good weapon. And the portal gun for whatever that's worth. And there you go! That's Terraria, everybody. What a journey. What a time we all had here playing Terraria. I had a pretty good time, I'd like to say. It's been a time since I've played it. And, you know, coming back to it is, uh... It's still as fun as ever, certainly. Now let's, uh, go craft them up, uh... Yeah, now I can finally make Luminite bars and do that sort of deal. But yeah, now I can get all the most powerful garbage possible. That's good stuff. And let me tell you, this is some powerful garbage. Like Star Dust Crusader's Helm. Everything like that. Ah! Now for all the wave events. No. <laughs> Crazy Blade Typhoon is pretty good, isn't it? But yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much all she wrote, I'd like to say, for Terraria. So, um, yeah, let's, let's just call it a day here then. Good night, everybody.